Hello, what's the crack? What's the story? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today we're checking out Steve Hughes, Junkies or Heroin Connoisseur. This is weird. Let's go. In Newtown one day, just at the Aporto Chicken there, waiting for a friend of mine, right? Now two, what we call junkies. In the age of political correctness, how everybody's not allowed to say anything anymore in case someone gets offended. Junkies. Don't seem to get that privilege, do they? They just... <laughs> just still fucking junkies. <laughs> just... <laughs> junkies and Christians. Just... <laughs> you know, you can still just get your fucking Jesus freak, your fucking God botherer, your fucking religious nut. No one goes, to anything, who gives a fuck? Yeah. Junkies. So I'm sitting there going, okay, I hate political correctness as much as the next intelligent person, but if we're gonna live with this rubbish, heroin connoisseurs. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm at the Porto waiting for my friend and a couple of connoisseurs came in. <laughs> they uh, girlfriend, boyfriend couple, and they're gonna order some lunch. I was impressed with. <laughs> now, I thought I probably shouldn't watch this, but oh, I'm gonna. <laughs> now, the fella, he was like this. Oh, God. What the fuck? She was doing the ordering. I just... <laughs> Can I get the uh There's a young kid behind the counter. He's just... I'm <laughs> 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 gonna get the snack box. And... Now I'm watching this just going, this is <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's mad. I see that a lot in McDonald's here yeah, in Birmingham. A lot, a lot. People just start just, uh, like, "Are you okay? Is everything all right?" It's so scary when you see them doing it. It's so scary, man. Eventually, the food comes. The poor girl, man. She picks up her chips. And then it starts. Just. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going. This is this is brutal, man. <laughs> yeah, it is. And then it. she said something I've never heard anybody say before. Right? She just looks down, just the bag in her hand. And she looks at the kid and she gives me. Me chips fell out of the hole. <laughs> what? Whoa. The poor kid's going, oh, it's because the whole... <laughs> Gravity fucks with the hole. It's, it's, you've got to keep the hole. I'll get you another hole. I'll get you another hole. <laughs> now I'm watching, and I'm going, oh, man. This is brutal, man. But I don't know their lives. 
past, you might have thought, you fucking mess, but you, you know, I don't know their lives. What's, what's brought someone with our big brains and our, our ability to think and the imaginative co creators in the universe, and yet some of us end up, you know, True. up like this? What the fuck is going on? And it was sad, man. And I remember just sitting there thinking to myself, I can't believe I'm single and this cunt's got himself a girlfriend. <laughs> Imagine. Oh, to be fair, that was a good, that was a good point, like, to be fair. At the end, I'm like, this is getting too slow for me now. But yeah, it was very good. The end was really good. The end, it made up for it. I feel like the first one I did, what did I do? Was it Live at the Apollo, I think. I really enjoyed that. That was way better. Than I, I like this as well, but that one was way, way better. That one, I was just laughing the whole time. But yeah, if you guys want to see more Steve Hughes, you know what to do. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.